Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Shamin. Today I'm going to talk about fermenters. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so fermenters. A fermenter is a giant steel cylindrical tank closed at both ends and designed to keep its inside environment and uh, favorable for the desired biological process to operate. So you can see here the diagram. Okay, so most industrial process use fermenters for the large scale and rapid production of microorganisms and their products. Okay, so present day uh, technology allow us to manipulate microorganisms genetically to produce a desired products. Okay, for example, production of human insulin. Okay and using fermenters to produce the gene products of such microorganisms is profitable and especially in the pharmaceutical industries and fermenters may, may be designed, uh, designed for anaerobic or aerobic process. Since most industrial processes are aerobic, so we shall outline the important features of this type of fermenter, okay? Cooling system. So removal of heat during microbial activities is vital for successful growth of the organism and cooling water runs through a cooling jacket and removes heat from the nutrients broth. And for very large fermenters, internal coils are provided through which cooling water flows. Okay, so you can see here diagram. And these ensure that the correct temperature is maintained within the cylinder. Okay, so this is a sparger air bubble. So this is an aeration device, and it is a metal ring with tiny holes through which air is passed into the um, into the fermenter and the high pressure. Air enters the fermenter as a tiny air bubbles and oxygen diffuses into the nutrient broth. Okay, and another one you can see. This is uh, impeller. Okay, so this is a, a seating device. Okay, and it mixes the air bubbles well with the nutrient broth, and this ensures that oxygen and nutrients are well within. Uh, a reaching of the microbes so microorganisms are mixed with nutrient broth and uh, culture medium so inside the cylinder where the oxygen concentration pH temperature and concentration of nutrients are uh, carefully monitored by a computer so guys I hope that's all thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe and share with your family and friends if you need more class go to my website www.advocatorsharmin.simplesite.com that's all